Louisiana has provided help to South Carolina in the years for Hurricanes Florence and Dorian, lending dozens of boat teams to assist. Five people from Anderson County face child sex trafficking charges tonight after an investigation that began in the spring. 7 News reporter Ann Maxwell has that. U.S. attorneys out of Greenville are prosecuting the case. Anderson County Sheriff Chad McBride says he is glad the suspects are facing federal charges because those typically carry harsher sentences. Gary and Shannon Garland are accused of advertising and trafficking two underage family members to engage in, quote, commercial sex acts. Anderson County Sheriff Chad McBride says the investigation began this spring. Somebody took notice of one of the children involved in the case, and uh, there was some... Um, things about the child that they picked up on, and I think, you know, that's kind of how conversation started. The Garlands were originally accused of criminal sexual conduct, but further investigation led to more charges. Because of the case, almost like a snowball, and, and you know, it gets bigger and bigger as the case uh, moves forward. Three others are also accused in the case. Johnny Wells, Michael Skelton, and Dewone Allen are charged with sex trafficking children. According to a spokesperson from the South Carolina U.S. Attorney's Office, they have admitted to having sexual relationships with the victims, but have not admitted to knowing they were underage. Gary Garland is facing more than two dozen charges, including sexual exploitation, criminal sexual conduct, and giving drugs to a minor. The people involved in this case are just sick and demented. The Garlands are also accused of using the victims to create child pornography. There's a lot of sick uh, people uh, that, that get involved in that kind of stuff and uh, certainly a lot of predators and uh, you know, just downright evil people out there that, that search that kind of content. Sheriff McBride says that if you see something unusual going on with the child, speak up. Homeland Security investigations in the Anderson County Sheriff's Office are still investigating. The sheriff says more arrests could be coming. In Greenville County and Maxwell 7 News. If you suspect someone may be a victim of human trafficking, you can report it to the National Human Trafficking Hotline. There's the number, 888-373-7888. We've written it as well at WSPA.com. VHEX says South Carolina had another 424.